Hi, this is Rockin' Robin. You are on Rockin' Robin's Garage Sale Fine, the YouTube channel that talks about reselling. And today we're talking about May, the last two weeks of May. What sold? Well, I'll tell you, I had lousy sales in May. I don't know if people are just going out to go shopping or what, but eBay sales, Macari sales, Poshmark sales, they were all down in the second half of May. Boy, I hope that doesn't keep up. I got to use some of my tips. I did. I put some stuff on sale. I did a lot of different things, but sales were still slow. But I am going to show you 15 items. I always show you 15 items around the 15th of the month and the first of the month that sold during the last two weeks. Now, I try to bring you a variety of different items so you can see some are expensive, some are not expensive tell you what I bought them for, tell you what I sold them for, just because it helps you learn and make more money. It's a tough one this month, but we're going to do it. Now, first, I want you to know, if this is your first time here, that we sell on eBay, and we have been selling on eBay for over 20 years, so we are really good at that. We sell on Mercari, been selling there for a few years, and we're happy with that. Liking it better every day. We do Poshmark. And uh, we sell a lot of clothes on Poshmark. Not a lot, but we sell clothes. We sell on Facebook Marketplace, and that's hot right now. And we sell at the flea market. And it's too hot for us to sell at the flea market because we're in Florida, and we sell from winter, well, actually fall to spring. So you stay with us. We'll be right back, and we're going to show you some of the sold items and tell you what we got for them, give you a lot of tips and secrets. Well, let's take a look at what we sold the last two months of May. Not a great month, but we did sell plenty of stuff. Let's see, we're starting off with this hockey. This is a Carolina Hurricanes a jacket, jersey, sweatshirt, I don't know, whatever you want to call it. And we did sell it. We've had this for a while. We had this when we bought a bunch of stuff that was uh, pretty much brand new that a sports person had brought to the thrift store. We, you know, we still have a number of these left, but we've sold quite a bit. And we did get some good profit on this since we bought it at four, $5. And the next one, this is a Mercari item. Now, I got this one at a garage sale for a dollar. I bought a bunch of stuff. Remember, I had $30. I bought all kinds of different things, hats and bobbleheads and good stuff. This one is a Vegas Golden Knights cap. That I bought for a dollar and I sold it right there. Pretty good, huh? 13. And uh, sticking with hockey, hockey is big right now because um, it's the playoffs and if your teams are doing well, you really want it. This was another one that I got from the store with the guy who went out of business. Um, this one I got for, geez, I want to say $2. I'm not 100% sure. It's been a long time now and I sold it for 25 bicycling is big right now because the weather is getting nicer so this is a brand new that i had gotten at the amazon return store that's no longer in business or not selling anyway and i got this i believe for a dollar could have been three dollars i'm not sure and i sold it i got this in october and bicycling stuff is doing well you got to make sure you have your bicycling stuff out right now let's see what else i sold Football never ceases to amaze me. Always selling NFL. Doesn't really matter what the season is. This is $1 an item I got at that garage sale where I got $30 and I bought a whole bunch of different stuff. So the Dolphins are expected to be good this year and people are preparing in advance. So have your NFL stuff out all the time. And uh, the baseball, it's baseball season. This is a Brandon Nemo. I got this at a uh, thrift store, I believe. And I don't think I paid too much. I think it was $2 or $2.50. And I just got that recently, so I've sold within a month. So I am buying bobbleheads. Bobbleheads do sell. People think they're not as big. Maybe they're not as big, but they do sell. Uh, this is a New York Yankees luggage tags. Um, I had gotten these at a garage sale. I believe somebody wanted three, not four, not 
two, so I had to break up the set, but that sold. So that was a good find. And I also sold a t-shirt, and this one was a billabong. I found this, oh gosh, a thrift store a couple weeks ago, and I was happy to sell that. I've been selling a lot of stuff I got at that particular thrift store. It's a couple hours away, but you know, you gotta drive further sometimes if you wanna get good stuff. And I've been finding that Billabong has been selling pretty good for me. I've got a couple of them now and uh, doing good. This is a 21 Pilots poster. I got this at the Amazon store. So I've had this for a while. I haven't gone to the Amazon store. I didn't go in this entire year. And I told you it's closed right now. I don't know if it's going to reopen, but it's closed. And I did get this for a dollar at the store. And I sold it on Mercari. So a lot of these are Mercari and some of these are eBay. This, a friend gave me these. Uh, she tried, she bought them. She didn't like them. She gave them to us, uh, said sell them. I put them up. They were gone in less than 10 minutes. I always like when that happens. I probably should have asked more. They're Crocs. It's one of the few shoes that I do always look for. I was happy that she had given me some that were Crocs. I wish they were my size and they weren't. And speaking of Crocs, I also sold these on Mikari. These are the Disney Crocs that I bought a lot of. And I think I only have one or two pairs left of these. I got these at the Disney store. When I go to the Disney store in either Fort Lauderdale or in Orlando, I tend to pick up what I think is good. And I picked up a lot of these. And like I said, two left. Now, the next thing I've got, another Disney item. Now this one, I believe I spent $6 for the shoes. I know I spent 25, so uh, it all depends. I have one more of these um, umbrellas for sale, and this one sold, I'm not sure which store I got this in. I think it was the very first one in Orlando. The next item sold on Mercari, and this is some Disney ears that I got at the Disney store. Now I got several different kinds of these and mostly the 4th of July ones are going really big but I've sold a couple other pairs with hearts and different things and I have a lot a lot of watchers and I get a lot of offers on these and I pay $2.99 for these I sell them for about $14 so there you go and the last Disney item that I believe that I'm going to show is this is a one of the wristbands you know you wear these they help you get in the store this is a Star Wars one I bought these ah I wish I could remember how much, $5.99, $4.99, somewhere in that range. And uh, this is actually, I believe, the first one that I sold, except the Dooney and Bork that I sold. All of a sudden, people are liking Ford. I got a bunch of these for a dollar each at the uh, Amazon return store when they were open. Everything Ford has become big right now. Even their stocks are starting to go way up. So I'm expecting, if you see things with Ford, buy them because uh, that's on the rise. So that's a good thing to look for. And the last item that I sold, yes, I did sell some pharmaceuticals. Testosterone, yes, I sell quite a bit of testosterone. Uh, I got these actually at the Amazon store. And I think testosterone and a lot of different things I got at the Amazon store sells over time. It's slowly, that's the way it is with all pharmaceuticals. I'm gonna look for more pharmaceuticals. So. Anyway, those are 15 of the most interesting items I thought you might enjoy that I sold in May. Well, welcome back. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope some of those items are things that you can resell on your own because that's always a big thing. Now, I want you to subscribe. I want you to hit the bell and I want you to give us a thumbs up. Those are important for us. Uh, we really want you to do those. And then what I want you to do is what I always want you to do, right? If you've been here, you know, find something good, put it up on eBay, put it up on Mercari, wherever you sell, and then you go make yourself some money. See you soon.